Live from central Pennsylvania, this is CBS 21 News This Morning. Good morning. It's Wednesday, December 4th. I'm Jesse McDonough. Here's what we're following right now. He's overseas right now, but President Trump will still be the focus today in the nation's capital. We're getting you ready for the next step in the impeachment inquiry. He's not here on behalf of, you know, doing something in the community for the community. He's here for himself. A presidential visit is just a week away, but members of the community say they don't want to foot the bill. The cost of the upcoming rally taking place in Hershey. And a teen accused of murder walked out of a detention facility. Now he's finally back in police custody, where authorities say they found the 17-year-old. But first, let's get a check of the weather with Steve Knight. Yeah, you know, pretty uh, amazing overnight. We got a little bit of light snow that was moving across the area. You're going to be brushing a little bit of that snow off your car this morning. Flakes falling overnight in spots across central PA. This is what it looked like in Harrisburg as the snow started falling just after midnight. Fortunately, outside of some wet roads, I don't think it's going to have too much of an impact here. Uh, on the morning commute it was mainly only able to stick to some of the grassier surfaces. Reason being is our temperatures have been hovering right around that freezing mark or higher here overnight. We've got a leftover snow shower you could see uh, making its way through Lancaster County. Southern York still could be seeing a couple of snow showers, but it is pushed out of the Harrisburg area and all that moving uh, from west to east. But you notice even with the snow showers coming down in Lancaster, it's currently 34 degrees. So it's really not able, thankfully, to stick to the road surfaces. So shouldn't be too much of a headache for you this morning. We'll look for a stray shower to pop up later on this afternoon. 